Story
ili chintuwe chupa kana wangibagi ito fungu wata na nchipozi chovola ba ebi mumieze vili mbanu sesto yani na li njiga tena ndiza atikisanya chilala kumbo mbrawe ama nyo chese ila waluko nebecharu ma mbantuba fe atina mwe sayi giri ndala kabaka sayi giri ya tulabi saa faba mtu wajianga kwa njaga kayumba haba mtu njaga la chino njaga la chino haba mtu njaba funa mtu Mutima, mutari mchi, mwungi. Kati ewe nitu kino vile edo kukua ako ni alani. Netaniko kwe uze vile uzo luwa chinze. Kwa zile uwe mbela kutibi. Nela wa mchara anga akaba. Kiba angu vye mnyumba. Echa vye nkira. Echa ante esa uwe duwalidu. Kuyamba bantu utafwa. Kati ya teka uwe duwalidu kuyamba bantu utafwa. Kaba tati ya. Nengamba. Mkonsuwense ya angi. Hili kampara. Mkonsuwense ya angi. Hili kampara. Duachi, ebi nitu inaate biya kwe masaka, atiba kwa tanze na ala nyabe kampala, ataba vamo konsuwe sezo, bonga tili yaba njizeko. So, ebi uzi ebyo, de mwandiba denga mwe buza, okusiko gamba, wundi, atili ya duachi, ya furumi akia, wundi ya koza akia, kumanga, enfuruma ya fenga wana lebala ni wako banki, ya lima teka, atete ya testi wako. Chino chidamu, teli ya tute seza, atina fete tuwe te seza, okututa. Edembe liyo, na dana kwa kuachi dewele, na dana kwa kusiri dewele, na dana kwa kusiri vinyi sisa dewele. Ati tu sawa la polisi sa kuhuti sisi baadhi, ati kuchibu wali ba ba kuata, ba kuati la mukapasti chini. Tu baangu baangu samu ni ba kupala miti le baangu kuata. Ne ya tu mazoe gamba na tisi sisi na tisi sakuchi. So eche chibu zote eche chibu dechi ni nini yeri mwe abamauli le, na muga gamba, ono wali wakuti sisi, tu wapa ngao wakuti sisi, ba mufai wakuti sisi na yaani. Ani ya tukua ata, no kutu sakati tumayi wachi kwa kwa atiku. No kutu sakati, ya tumayi nisonga ya tukua asa. No kutu sakati, ya tumayi ani ya tukua ata. Katoni za kunga ama, nagini tesa, nga tesa nani. Soto wali woku tesa. Wabula, echatu tesa, kanchibagambo uwari yoba tumuchimanyi. Echatu tesa, chari wechiti. Echatu tesa, ye pressure, banama uwe ni mwate kawo. Echatu tesa, ye pressure wa sufutu soja, jibate kawo. Echa tutesa, ye international community okuteka kulesha kugwanga Uganda, kituwachi mkwa atila abantu, obwerele. Atenga tucharwana na kwefe kwa afrumye, ni wanda fabala laba kwa ajiwa, atiwe kubanga na kote bayina, rosango, abali mkoti macho, na abali mkoti sedala, na kutu sababa tegu, nga furu kwa tegu, na uwa tegu kwa tebali na musango. Echa tutesa, echidala, ye mela kusuwe seza fe, abalozi wa fabake kwa mkupari ya mele. Jibati ni kawo. Jibati ni kawo. Jibati ni kawo. Jibati ni kawo. Kwa chumwa kwa chumwa kwa chumwa. Echirali ya chatu kesa. Nga tewali ujulizi. Kutuguma. Kusegeza ya tukua ata. Ya tukua ajiza. Ye ya fumba ufumbi chintu che. Na chiteka wawo. Ati nga tichiri kwa ujulizi. Kwa nga ni mwa mba ni mkoti nga mudia. Nibe bagama antipe watu umidiza. Vavayo. Nibe bagama antia haa. Kwa watu kuwanga migu. Kwa watu kwa mbalu umidiza la nise wanyana. Banku wanga migo mba wanga mbalu umidiza seki zinyo wanga migo. Chechanku yangi migo. Ida wu nebanka kanko li statement ki. Ki yogu chi. Ki yogu limba. Chite giza. Naba anago. Kukufa ni wako mfesi. Nga tiba nene. Kena fao. Kukufa mba jatenga wichidi. Oda ba nze nala ni. Otuga tobu ga singa tutu mde kumeza. Tenti chisoboka. Wanga banga ala ni yaba deo na ngidi yamba deo. Wona umumuri de kama denti mira na yeye kwanza kwanza yeye mira na kijiji ba demira na na yeye ati wenzake chukamba chukia tu basa kubantu abalala ati mtu tamani nolo hicho elia tu teesa biyo presha ya moe amama uli de amani gamu gamu ati kwa u muga ati nda abantu bano baba kwa chida we irumbra bi wafu nuzi ni na pondo kuna gani muna abantu bano na kiliza, nifuwe imiriwa nifuma. Nebu niluwa gamba, tuwari wo kutesa, wo kutesa kuchi. Ere yu kwe shwa, yutuma nje wa jumina mikuwe jamwe, yu kutesa, mwa tesa kuchi, mwa kola chi, tuwari, tuwari wo kutesa kuchi. Na, echo, bandama uliye, njaka na mwendo wano, 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 njaka Chini mungu sisi zetu tusiwe kubanga tu mdo wa kuvia. Wazi wa tebani yangu jambo la jambo la kufeshi. Kusoka hengi la kufeshi ni nini la kufeshi? Kwa wengine kwa wazi yangu jambo. Wachifanya kwa wengine wakuna ni nasikini kansa.
Mbina guwaraga tila sinza kudamu guwaraga Chibu mba wenvansi vila na liufu nedua Etagala munu na ilo biosito Etagala elio Lingi ambako Kure yangi chibu mba chitelea Wenvansi vila sinza mufu na kutagala elio liuna Ila chibu mba bagi nzo kudamu chike vila Kudama wagageze Echirala Nina hypertension Hypertension ni Eji wabuwe ya ngiri Fundu eji offer 140 Kakati iba haba sawa wa nubo nabi haba limidua Nga solution ni ya kugenda in the night of the hospital Kwa mungu siza haba zungu Endala Pagenda bako lachi Bako kujianjaba Nukutu suruwa leo Kituna bako genda kujianjabi kwa Uwe nsonga Passport za fe Za kwa atikwa Kena za asigala yungo musingo Nga kufuna chi Nga kufuna beyo Choko ya kugamba wateisa Ne passport yo tusobola jaksesi Sina jifuna Kati mutu wateisa na hiru wati passport Haita kitu mgaani Mbango wali wukutisa, katuwa chitu mga hati mwune wikuwa tisa, awo yu tisa, kashifu passport. Tuwa mga hati isa wala. Nye passport, yu kuchalwa na nzo, kukuna nga tuu yu itamo mitendele mitufu, ya wala ya wala kwa wakeba wani ike, basifuwe. Nye ukusu wali ro, kochi, tena damo kwa echo. Nolu echo, kituwa saba gada wa fi, kuchalwa kwa wadi. Nga kuchalwa na ukura mga tuwa yunga yu kichanja we. Na wala nzi wa fi, na uwe ita kutu wala kira masa mga tuwa yu kuruungi, kujia kuonge la kona Nefu kwa zei kule selo, mkula banga kwa agara, hivi mwuzi hivi nji, hivi jami tumajawa na Uganda, mvemu, nadala hivi mwuzo, chiti kwa kwa kesa, hivi chuchipa na chiku jiga, mba kwa mba, edembe ya fi, hati kwa 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 Okay. Uh, so when we say that you can begin with the English version and then later shall get to one of the balance. I think that they are coming in question. No, they wanted you to give a recap of what we just said in English in Uganda, in the summer and English, such that they can also complain to the English speaking people. Very happy to see you here. My name is Asi Kirija Muhammad, MP representative of the Rwepe North. Together with my own of the Honorary Ballad, Mr. Wanyana, who is the Honorary Ballad. We are happy that we are out, but as we start, we are still sick. The reason why we decided to come and address this press conference is to answer some of the questions which we've been asking ever since we are released, and some of the questions why was there was negotiations. Towards our release, I'm here to answer that question that there was no negotiation. It was law that worked upon us so that we get out. Given the pressure of the foot soldiers, the journalists, uh, our party leaders, they made fundamental all towards our needs. That's why we are out. So we have to tell you that there was no negotiation that was that has been your big question with the journalists because have been admitted as the uh, people and this following social media platforms but the big question was that so we take our big thumb, our party leadership, that they made fundamental towards our needs. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, Yeah, too. First of all, 
Irish ourselves in the public. Secondly, answer a few questions which have been raised earlier about our incarceration and about our release. Some questions wouldn't have appeared had we not been in a competitive environment politically. Because there is no way someone can be released from prison over issues you well know that these were family matters. And then you ask how, why. But because of the nature of the environment that we live in, Politically, the way we get these conditions that we, we do sit in, there are those who think that by putting an indelible mark on Honorable Alan Sawanyana and Honorable Segirinya's name, after two years of imprisonment, after two years of pain to him and his family, and these colleagues, after two years of fight between the opposition and the government over their release, and after two years of fight by our lawyers and the state to see us go free, would be a very good thing to those ones. Ladies and gentlemen, we take this opportunity to thank each and every person, each and every brand who thought otherwise. We were arrested on the 9th of September 2021 over matters we don't know about. But we are put there. We are also surprised to see that our names are implicated in such acts, which is not our way of doing things. We have grown from Uganda and we have grown from within the society. We are ghetto kids. We came from new people. We did not come from heaven or from another country to come to Uganda. You know our discipline, you know our ways of doing things, and you know how we have walked all this path to where we have been or where we are as members of parliament. Personally, this is my second term in parliament. What, what, what would push me to do things that I did not do in the first term of office? It means that th those that I did that actually proved to my voters that I'm what a member of parliament and hence gave me another term of office, they are the ones that I had to strengthen and improve on so that I can get another term if I so wish. So there is no way we could get involved in such acts. But of course, these are matters before us. We cannot delve into them so much. I know God is with us, Uganda is with us, and very soon the truth shall come out. On the matter of how we are released and why we didn't uh, talk to the media very quick after our release, as it has been with all other uh, people who have been incarcerated before, because we are not the first ones to be incarcerated. One thing, different people react to different situations differently. Secondly, different situations occur differently. I, for one, I was released when even sitting, I cannot. When even standing, I cannot. When even talking, I cannot. I had a very serious issue, a complication in my lungs, beneath my breast. It, is a, it was a clotting. And some of you, the journalists, and even the public, you saw what happened. Even in prison, they took me to Mlago Hospital for referral. And even the judge in Masaka had told the prison to get for me specialized treatment over the same issue. 
So I came out weak, not talking very well, psychologically tortured. I was to a point of seeing a psychiatrist and a psychologist just to rebuild my mind and brain. So we weren't in a position of very good sense to talk. The world does not end at certain times. We found it so worthy that after us getting relief, getting some energy, we could come and talk to you. And here we are. There are some people who say that we cannot come to our party headquarters. But today we are here. And we are going back and coming back to our party. That has been the propaganda which has been moved around. <coughs> by our would-be opponents in the political environment that we live in. About negotiating our leaders, I don't think we needed that. We have paid lawyers to work upon our leaders, and they have fought so much. We thank them. Our lawyers have been aided by the road mayor of this city, a person whose character, a person whose way of doing things I know is a proven man. He cannot go through corners to do something, however much it would benefit him. He has been heading our legal team and is the one who was in charge of our pay application. And he knows how he got that pay application. By the way, it was general knowledge. It was before a court of law, before a judge, and all what happened in court, you were there, very present. The terms and conditions that were stated, we gave out money, we gave money for our pay. Our passports are, are still held in the judiciary. We were put under some conditions which you had, that you do not talk about the case. So, there is no way such a thing could happen. I get worried that instead of celebrating our release and my release, someone views the story just to tarnish our names, because after two years of incarceration, in our generation, there is no politician who has suffered for two years in jail over political matters. Who is to be a member of parliament in this country? So it is history. So celebrating that history has been a bitter pain for some politicians in Uganda. And that sense, building propaganda that there is something fishy about our ladies. Fellow Ugandans, do not fall for that. We have been there for you, we have suffered, and our backs are not yet broken. We are here sitting at our party headquarters. We list some people building propaganda earlier that we cannot sit here, but we are here today. In Uganda, we say, that Mulimba and Guana Mukiriza. Today we are here, and that one who said that they cannot go there, we are here. I read a story today in the Observer. They say, why are they so quiet? But we are talking to the very day you were putting up a story. So it means that we are talking to the very day you were putting up a story. So it means that we are talking to the very day you were putting up a story. So it means whoever gave that story to the Observer, it was a wrong one. <coughs> I don't castigate a newspaper, but the one who gave the story had his own motives. Next Thursday, they will write they have spoken. <laughs> and that is very good for us. I thank all Ugandans who have played a very big role towards our release. I know it hasn't been a very easy story. You have toiled. <coughs> from leaders of our party, headed by the party president, Mr. Chabula, 
the whole opposition parties like uh, FDC and other parties, all of them, they have worked hand in hand to see that they talk about our release because it is our right under the constitution of Uganda. Religious leaders, all of you, we thank you. You have put to notice that we have put release. We have got to Uganda. He has always come out to talk for our release. And all our other cultural leaders that have seen it worth it for us to be released because we have no case to maintain that we are innocent. All Ugandans, all Ugandans that have played a very big role towards our release, we thank you. You are our heroes. Thank you, the journalists. We thank you so much, the media. We thank you all, even the proprietors of those media stations for allowing such a message for our freedom to go through your media houses. You are our heroes. That's why we are out. For anyone who is asking how we are they raised, why are they out? It is because of those people that I mentioned that we are out. We thank you all. We thank our party uh, spokesperson for giving us this opportunity to talk to the media and the Ugandans at large. We still pray and we ask you to continue praying for us because we are still battling with the same issues in courts of law, but I know that we will win. With good, all things are possible, and we are innocent. We are going to continue working for our constituencies. The very much energy we had before going to prison is the same energy we are going to maintain. We shall continue to fight against corruption. We shall continue to fight for all those who have been incarcerated over political reasons. We shall continue to advocate for their release because you've also advocated for our release. We shall continue to talk in Parliament about issues that do create freedom in our country and the rule of law in Uganda shall advocate as we have been before. I thank you all for the waiting questions. Thank you. All right, I will take uh, a few questions very, very quickly. Um, those that are going to ask in Uganda, you'll ask in Uganda. Those that are going to ask in English, you'll ask in English. All right. Uh, I will take yours. Then I'll take him. I'll take Winu. I will take uh, uh, Nation Media. Uh, of course, uh, The Observer. <laughs> uh, 